Hey guys, it's Evil Undercover, and today I'm going to be showing you how to stop Battlefront 2 from crashing to desktop when you try to start it up. Now, I've been having an issue with this for with a few of my games, and I've seen a lot of things saying, oh, just disable your sound and it'll work, but I like to play with sound, so here's a way to fix it without disabling your sound. Now, what most people would normally do is just create desktop or shortcut to desktop like this and then launch it from there but no that's not what you want to do in this case you want to open up your file explorer and go to where your steam is installed so for me I'd have these all have steam games on it but go to the disk that it has is installed to so my local disk C is where I have mine installed go to program files 86 for 64 bit and program files for 32 bit go to steam Steam Apps, Common, Star Wars Battlefront 2, and Game Data. Now, right here, set, uh, right click right here, send to desktop, then you'll have this. Now, the reason you do this is because if I were to right click on this and click properties, this is all you see. There's no target tab anywhere. If I do it with this one that we just created, I click properties and here's the target. So prove that this works I'm going to delete this one that's the one that I use just drag this one into here now right here in the target area area at the end you want to put a space slash win now this will start your game in a window when you launch it so now if I launch this you click play it launches in the small window now at first I didn't think this was going to work because it I don't like playing in small windows like this. Now, if I wait for this to load up real quick and bypass all of that, if I go into my options and first off, turn on my audio, holy crap. <laughs> um, if I go into my video, you see I have it set to 780 by or 1280 by 720 for 720p, but it's obviously not. So just set it to whatever resolution you want and then launch a game so I'm going to go into instant action and launch Geonosis LPR this custom map and now as you can see when I launch it it fixes the resolution to go to 720p now this will work and yeah so you can see that I can play perfectly fine now and that I know it is a bit smaller than it should be but or it could be if I were to play in full screen, but as you can see, it is working, and I do have sound. So this that uh, this is how to fix your Star Wars Battlefront 2 crash to desktop issue without having to disable sound. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make comment, subscribe. Hope this helped you guys out, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.